Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited today. Got my melanin hair care products. I've been stalking the post office for my products. UPS said it will be here yesterday. UPS, the United States post office was janking me around. They didn't deliver it till they delivered mail today. So I was not happy with them. I was expecting to come home from work and unbox my products. I'm so excited. Oh my God, oh my God. I've been watching Natural 85 since I went natural. I'm so excited to see that she developed her own products. Hey Whitney. Hi. That is just too cute. Packing info. Oh my God. Oh. Got a head wrap. Got a head wrap. This is huge, O-M-G. This is huge. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Great job, Whitney. Where's my sucker? No sucker. Bummer. But this is the star of the show. Melanin, melanin, twisted, elongated style cream. Oh my goodness. Can't wait to use this. Let's see what it looks like. Nice and creamy. Oh, it's nice, rich, and silky. People been saying it smells like shea butter. I really don't get a shea butter smell. Oh my goodness. Maybe because I use shea butter all the time. But it smells like nothing to me. No, I don't get that shea butter smell. Feels like a rich thick conditioner can't wait to try it out on my hair feels good got a little wetness to it oh thanks Whitney Say hi to Olivia Felipe. And I forgot, what's the song name? Oh man. And a new arrival to the batch. I'm so excited. I guess I'll be trying this out on my hair real soon. Thanks guys. everyone I want to come back for my one week update on my new product that I got my melanin elong twist elongating style cream um, that was done by Whitney and um, I only bought the style cream I didn't get the oil because right now I have a large supply of oils so once I I uh, use up the oils that I have, then I will um, see about testing out the, the oil. But what I did was a wash and go two days, and I'll insert some pictures on what my wash and go looked like. And then I twisted my hair up, and um, my hair has been in twists maybe about three days now. So. 
Um, I would say because, well, it for the twist, I would say that it does exceptionally well. Now my hair is a little finicky when it comes to glycerin and this product does have glycerin in it and it is in the middle of the road when it comes to the ingredients list but however I usually try to stay away from glycerin so I'm kind of on the fence with this product I love the way it makes my hair feel when I do um, a twist out or even not just a twist out I love the way it makes my hair feel when I put the product on it feels so smooth it um, it smooths the hair shaft down really well my twists I take them down they have great definition I can even comb through my hair <laughs> And that's something that I don't do on dry hair. However, so this, I would never do this on, on dry hair. And I haven't wet my hair in about three days. Like I said, I've had these twists in my hair for about three days. So it's, it feels nice and moisturized. Feels really good. But I don't usually wear my hair in twists all the time. I usually do a wash and go. Put a little conditioner in it and go. So because this has glycerin in it, by the end of the day, my hair is swollen. There is no definition. It feels great. Don't get me wrong, it feels great. But because it has glycerin in it, my hair swells up to a short, frizzy tennis ball. But it feels awesome. I wish you could actually feel my hair. But aesthetically, it doesn't look very well. If I take these twists out and if I were to leave them out they would shrink and my hair would be frizzy. And all the definition that I've acquired just from keeping them in twists would be gone. I mean it feels so good. It, my hair feels awesome. It's still moisturized. Got a little oil still in my hair and like I said I would never take a comb nor a brush to my hair when it's dry never so because it has that god awful word glycerin I I I won't be able to use it as an everyday product if I want to twist my hair up leave my hair in twists for a protective style yes it would be awesome at that but to take it out and try to wear my hair as a twist out to try my wear to wear my hair as a wash and go it would be a hot frizzy mess and i am just really so disappointed because i was stalking her website i was stalking the postman I'm just really disappointed. It is a great product. Don't get me wrong. It is a great product. Whitney did an awesome job. But my hair does not react to glycerin very well. Some products, when I put it in my hair, immediately it turns into a frizzy Brillo ball um, like the ones that you buy the SOS pads that's what glycerin makes my hair look like and I'm gonna insert some pictures of what my hair looks like when I have products with that contains no glycerin and what my hair looks like when 
um, I use this product. I mean, it feels awesome. It is so moisturized. Guys, I'm just, I'm just really disappointed. I hope she come out with new products and, you know, that are glycerin free. And because it is so hard to find products that does not contain, contain glycerin. I'm not going to throw it away. I, I'm going to keep it because like I said, it makes my hair feel so awesome. It is well moisturized. And also it works well in my, my daughter's hair and my granddaughter's hair. So they're able to tolerate glycerin a little bit better than I am. But for me, glycerin is a no-no. So they'll be able to use it. I'm just so disappointed. And I didn't use much. I didn't use much at all. I, and my daughter used this. I used this. I've been using it for about, about a week. Yeah. She's been using it. So I'm just so disappointed. <laughs> but you guys, if glycerin is not a problem for you, I would highly recommend it. And I know earlier I said it didn't really smell like anything, but because I make my own shea butter um, that I put in my hair, I am accustomed to the smell of shea butter. But it does have a slight shea butter smell. It's not overpowering. It dissipates over the time. Um, I love the fact that you get 16 full ounces of the product. I'm just disappointed because it has glycerin in it and my hair does not take to glycerin very well. As you see, my twists are super juicy. And it twisted right on back up. Awesome. But because it has that G word in it, which I call the devil, it just doesn't work very well unless I'm gonna have my hair like this. <laughs> So, hey, I would say go for it if you're thinking about it. Like if your hair tolerates glycerin very well, then go for it. It is awesome. But this would be the only way that I would be able to use it in my hair. And when I look at Whitney videos and I see how plump and juicy her twist is, I get so jealous. <sighs> but thanks guys, I appreciate you watching the video. If you would, rate, comment, subscribe, um, share, and hit the, the bell so you know when I do a new upload. And I'll talk to you later on the next one.